is Jesus Manuel Mena Garza. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Yesterday I received a very nice package and it came from the folks at uh, Hallowview. Very nice uh, package here. It's an MC7109 uh, backup camera for my travel trailer. They were very generous to send it to me. And I look forward to doing several reviews again on the MC7109 with the 7 inch monitor. It also came with uh, uh, this box, which has a side marker camera. So, not only the rear view camera, but the two side marker cameras, which I'll be attaching to my travel trailer. In this video, I'm just going to give you a short introduction. I plan to do several other videos, installation videos, my experience with the Halview system videos. So, this is just the first of many videos on the Halloview system. Again, Halloview is pretty much a premier manufacturer of backup cameras, and I think they're significantly better than the folks at Furion. But what do you think? Do you think Furion's better or Halloview's better? Uh, there, there are two options out there essentially on the market. A lot of smaller players, but those are the two big players, okay? So this unit came with uh, this backup camera. I'm going to be showing some close-ups after this introduction uh, portion of the video and I'm going to show you some close-ups of the video and explain some of the specs. But here's a tight shot of the backup camera. Uh, coming with it are various cables and various connections and uh, accessories. But this is the main one right here. This sort of uh, connects right here and it sort of twists and is very tight and waterproof. And this connects to your Furion uh, assembly. A lot of uh, travel trailers are pre-wired for Furion, so this just essentially just snaps into place. Just install a few uh, screws. You have to take off this little backer plate and uh, replace it with this backer plate. And it's pretty simple, just four screws and this little item here. And of course, you do have to have to do some caulking. The kit also came with a couple of uh, side marker cameras. Here's a couple of them. One and two for all you folks out there. So these are incredibly well built, just like the uh, backup, camera, backup camera. Very, very high quality. Again, the premier manufacturer of, of backup and side marker cameras and monitors, okay? So this replaces the side marker and you have a camera and there's one for the left and for the right. This would go, I would place this on the passenger side and has its own antenna which moves also. This screws off, I just attached it a little while ago. So I'm going to be going in depth in a few seconds on this one. Of course it comes with a monitor. This is a 7 inch monitor. I attach the antenna to it too and it has a little area in the back where you can you know, connect it to either a, a window suction mount or a, a dash mount. You have various options. So this is the unit. It's a good size as compared to my big fat head. And it has buttons here and uh, it's going to be very useful. So I look forward to doing some more videos in the future. Essentially an installation video. Also a how is it working with me video. Doing the side markers video and uh, you know a review down the line. What do you think? So coming up next is, uh, I'm going to be going in depth. I'm going to show you each individual item, doing some, uh, showing you some video of them, showing the different parameters and some of the specs. So let's get into that right now. First off, the build quality of this camera is A+. It has a glass lens and the housing is super, super solid. It shoots a uh, video at uh, 1280 by 720 pixels and uh, the latency is 200 milliseconds and one thing that's very very important is a waterproof rating IP69K you can't get really much better than that the viewing angle 120 degrees and it does uh, record audio as you're going down the road it can handle temperatures as low as minus 4 degrees and above 155 degrees that's some great you know options there there's a little plate that uh, that allows you to, you know, make it fit a Furion mount on most travel trailers. So as you can see here, there's the camera with the antenna. And it says 
camera on the antenna so you know which one to put it on. And this is the attachment that you can uh, make it really simple, super simple. Even a dummy like me can connect this to a Furion mount on a travel trailer. And my new travel trailer, my new uh, uh, Rockwood Mini Light 2205S has the Furion mount. So I'm just going to take off that back plate and add that other plate and attach this little uh, cable and I'll be all set. Easy peasy. I think there are about a dozen videos on how to install these uh, Haloview uh, side marker and uh, the observation uh, backup camera. I look forward to checking them out. As you can see there the antenna comes off and there's a specific uh, camera for the left and the right. Don't get them confused, of course. Here's a nice side shot. I thought that I'd share that with you. I really like the design of these cameras. They're very, very high quality. Here's the monitor. It has some very uh, tactile uh, buttons there. Uh, some of us old school people like buttons once in a while. Here in the back is where you can connect a bracket for a suction cup on the window or a little pad that goes you know, on your dash. You have various options. Again, this is a big unit. It's seven inches. I really like the layout of the buttons here. It really helps me out. Thanks for watching my video. I hope you like it. I hope it was informative. And again, I'm going to be doing some other videos, installation videos of the, the backup, you know, observation camera and the side marker cameras and uh, some experience down the road and how it's working out for me. Again, Haloview is pretty much the premier manufacturer of backup and observation cameras, and they do a great job. They're super high quality. They're very well built. From Fort Worth, Texas, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. I would greatly appreciate it. And if you have the time, please leave your kind and super friendly comments below. Hope you're doing fantastic wherever you're at. Gracias. Adios. Bye-bye.